You think our skirts are too short for law? My skirt is up in the back. When we walked in there, I was like, Jesus, please. Like, I didn't even know college classes looked like courtrooms like this. Hello, how y'all doing? How are you? It was very much straighten up and try to be as polite and not get in trouble as possible. Now, when we come to law class, we gotta dress a little different. Girl, we look like the defendants. <laughs> they are the prosecutors. We are the defendants. <laughs> we are all on trial over here. As soon as we walked in, you could tell we did not dress right. Hello. Hi. Welcome to law school. You have the pleasure of being taught by Judge April Walker. One of her mandates is that when she walks into a room, you rise. Additionally, when she speaks to you, you rise. Yes. Do I sit down when I'm done? She'll tell you when to sit okay, down. Okay, got it. If she doesn't tell you to sit down, don't sit down. Say no more. All right. She got the rule of when I tell you stand up and when I tell you sit down, baby, it's about to be a challenge. You've been at the undergrad school. Things are about to change. Now you're here at Thurgood Marshall School of Law. We are a professional school. We have higher goals. Let me tell you how this is gonna work. You see them class rules down there? Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Uh-huh. Briefs are to be what? Handwritten. Computers, electronic devices, and cell phones. Uh-uh, not in the classroom. We don't do that, do we? Judge Walker is not playing. Because I will do what? Confiscate. She got to be related to Herschel Walker the way she was running in place. It's some gangster. And so I am here to give you all some information about the law. This is an interesting class. So it's useful outside of here because I can actually apply it if I was to get pulled over by a policeman, I would know my all my rights. If I have a friend going through a trial or whatever situation, you know, I would have the knowledge of what's really going on, you know what I'm saying? I want you to get the basic knowledge. What do I need? How's this gonna help me? Baby, looking at this syllabus, look like we about to get a crash course in court procedures and our basic constitutional rights. I'm tired just looking at it. The Fourth Amendment protects us against what? I mean, it's probably no, 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 no. See, Miss Noah, we don't just talk in here. Oh, I'm sorry. I call on people. I'm a bad judge. I love Judge Walker. She's like an auntie, you know, who's very stern and don't play. If you would like to tell us, yes. stand up, please. Yes, yes. Room. OK. No, 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 you good. It's just, I want to just. Well, Miss No, Miss No Wood. Put your cigarettes back in your pocket. Huh? Put your cigarettes in your pocket. Oh, my bad, Judge. Okay. Sorry about that. We all have this right. Mr. Norwood, what does it protect us against? Probable cause? No, 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 no. What do you think? Miss Westbrooks, stand up, please. Yes, ma'am. She's just gonna randomly select anybody to talk and give their opinion or read. My heart sank to my ass because I don't do shit like that. Honestly, I'm not that familiar with okay. um, yeah. this. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sit down, Miss Noah. Sit down. Judge Walker wants to call me out for some shit. Like, all that work I just did in my self-empowerment session has just been washed.